ready. Let's do it. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. I am super excited for today's vlog. If you follow me on Instagram, you know that me and my boyfriend had a fur baby join our family and I decided to film the whole thing and launch my YouTube career with a puppy vlog. A better way, honestly. You guys get to see my little man Moose. You guys get to see right before we got him, when we got him, and kind of the whole first week experience. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy this video and come join my family. I'm going to be posting videos every Wednesday, every week. Let's jump right in to the video. So I think I should start off with how we found our dog. We actually were looking really, really hard at rescues and shelters. We applied for a few dogs and none of them ever responded back to us. And then the dogs kept being reposted on Facebook. So we just weren't a good fit for any of the dogs that we really wanted. So we decided to go on to Kijiji and see what we could find. We definitely weren't, weren't looking to spend like a thousand dollars on a dog. We wanted to keep the number relatively low unless we found like the perfect dog for us. I would say that our budget was between five and $700. So that's kind of where we wanted to keep it at. So one day I decided, you know what, I have had enough. We really didn't want to wait until the spring to get a dog. So I logged onto Kijiji, I changed the province. And on the seventh page of my Kijiji ad, there was this little Rottweiler space and he was, he, he was ours. Like we saw the picture and we knew this dog needed to be ours. So. I messaged the lady, she was talking to me, asking me questions, and then she asked me if I have ever um, like trained and owned a big dog on my own before. And I said, never on my own, but I've um, dog sat Rottweilers before. Um, I had a Rottweiler in my life for a little while and she was amazing. I've literally loved them since I was a child. My boyfriend and I love dogs, whatever. She read my message and she stopped answering. My boyfriend and I were like, okay, well, typical, that's usually what happens and then they never get back to us, whatever. And so the next morning I wake up, she'd emailed me and sent me pictures of the parents, asked me if I had any questions. And before we knew it, we were sending in our deposit and we got our Mooser man. Oh, he was so perfect. He was the last one left in his litter. He was the smallest guy. Um, turned out he was the runt of the litter. So like, he's not gonna become a giant unit of a dog. We were told two weeks later, we can go get this dog. So we sent the deposit and had everything done on the Saturday right after Christmas. So by the end of that weekend, um, we, we had our dog, whatever. We get a text halfway through the week and she asked if we would like to come pick up our dog a little bit earlier, that he wasn't nursing on his mom anymore. He was old enough to go home and they just had like an emergency to tend to the weekend after. So we're like, sure, yes, we'll, we'll come get him. We got to get him or we got to pick him up one week early. We had to literally jump in the truck, go to the pet store, get absolutely everything we needed to be prepared. We set it all up and then the next day we woke up at 7 a.m drove five hours and got our dog. Today's the day. We get our puppy today. Public service announcement. My hair this particular weekend was so frizzy. So I apologize for how crazy it looks. I did everything I could to try to tame it and there was nothing that was gonna help it out. I don't know what was going on, but she was not having it last or that weekend. So at least we know my hair. <laughs> He's cute otherwise. We are, sorry, I gotta grab this phone charger while I'm holding you in here. We are about to head out. It's gonna get a little dark in here. Um, I'm so excited. We have all of the things. We have our whole setup here. I didn't show you last night. It's a nice little playpen. We got everything that we need. So I'm so pumped. I can't wait to have them forever. I will see you guys when I get there. Okay, we're gonna get this off of you because it's <laughs> on you. Hi, Moose. Whoa. Here, off. <laughs> off. Where's his leash? It's called. <laughs> Whoa. You are all cool now. <laughs> Sing up. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> you little stinker. Do you gotta go pee? I think we should take you out. He is so cute. Hi, sweetie. It's so cute.
so today is now the second day that we have had moves. I was gonna give you an update yesterday after the first night, but I ran on about three hours of sleep. Um, we didn't go to bed to about midnight because we needed to tucker him out. Um, and he got tired, he slept in his little pen. We went to bed and at 2 a.m. he was awake. I was awake pretty much from 2 a.m. till um, I went to bed last night at 10.30. Last night went better though, he slept way more, way longer, and things are looking up. I love having him in our house. I love being a little dog mom, and I can't wait to see him grow up. He is also doing so well. So we are looking into getting him booked for his vet checkup and getting all of his first shots. There is a lady in my city that does vet visits at home. So we're gonna check her out and see if she can just come to our house at the end of the month and give him a checkup and see him here because it gives me a ton of anxiety thinking about going to a vet right now. I can't go in there with him, especially for the first time. And I don't want him to be all scared, so. Right now, I am just sitting here filling out my journals and my manifestation journal. And then Moose and I are probably gonna just listen to some music. Why are you crying? Hello, Mr. Moose. Come say hi to everyone. See, hello everyone. <laughs> no, you can't have that. Who's that little handsome boy? Thank you. That is my second day update. No complaints from me. I am exhausted, but that's a small price to pay for such a freaking perfect little guy. So I love him so much. I'm gonna finish journaling and then him and I are gonna go play outside a little bit more. Exciting. Good morning, guys. Happy Sunday. Um, it has been officially one week since we picked up the little stinker. He is outside right now going to the bathroom. He is doing so well. He can tell us when he wants to go outside. He is so cute. So I will go outside and get some footage of him running around because he literally is cuter than a freaking, I don't even know, just the cutest thing on this planet. He loves sticks. He loves to pick up rocks and bring rocks everywhere. But he's running around with his sticks. So I'll show you. So I just gave Moose a Kong full of peanut butter, and I don't think he's gonna like it. Do you not like it? Look, here, you can have it, it's a treat for you. Not a fan. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> you hate it, hey? <laughs> just absolutely could not be bothered like, by it. Why am I being punished? <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay, I'll go clean it and get rid of all of the peanut butter out of it. That is ridiculous. There he is. He's so big now compared to how little he is in those videos. Anyway, thank you so much for staying tuned for my puppy vlog. I'm excited to continue to make more videos. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more. Also, give me a follow down here on Instagram. I'll put my handle across the screen. It's just at Tineal Presley. If you are coming from my vlog and you find my Instagram page, comment the dog emoji on my latest picture of Moose. <laughs> Thanks for watching.